first episode of the Weekly Realistic or Impossible. Let's break it down. Hello, welcome. My name is Guster Lappin once again, and today I will be analyzing the first episode of The Weeble Show, and we will see if this is realistic or impossible. The name of this episode we'll now be seeing is Welcome to Weebleville, which is an episode that has the same name as the DVD. And this episode is such a classic from Paramount and can also be my childhood since 2005 and 2006. And this is before I got into playing Wii and other games by Nintendo. And we know that we can tell when we watch something if it is real or if it's fake. And also, since this episode is animated, lots of people know that it's fake. And it is so excited to see different animals in the show as well. Now before we break this down, please leave a comment. Do you think it's actually realistic or do you think it's impossible? I really want to hear what you can think and we will reveal the surprising answer to this question at the end of the video. Now let's watch the episode. That fellow over there doing the Weeble Watt Tuesday is our mailman, Bumpus. Wow, what a good dance. Oh, it's my birthday and I'm so happy. This is where he's turning four. It's my birthday and I'm so happy. Happy, happy. Happy, happy, happy is right. Okay, the first thing that I see in this section is when Zuzi Q the chicken rushes by Bumpus the dog, he begins to spin, and as he does, the letters fling up and out of his mailbag, and there is no way on earth that this is happening. You know me, Bumpus. I'm a fireman. He's and passing the umbrella to Bumpus. Okay, so the next thing in this part that's kind of whimsical, it's very funny how he passes the umbrella as Tui the turtle throws it onto Bumpus's hand. When he opens the umbrella, it goes inside out instead of outside in. They cannot open up in real life like that. It's very unreliable. Good morning, Bumpus. Glad to see you got yourself an umbrella. Looks like rain, wouldn't you say? Well, Stamps, there's no rain in Weebleville. Some people use an umbrella in the sun, but in real life, people use that in the rain. <laughs> yeah? No kidding, Bumpus? You really think I could be right about the rain? Well, not at all. <laughs> when rain or shine, it's a great day to be a Weeble. <laughs> wow, you have such a nice laugh, Bumpus. I can hurry home <laughs> and make myself a nice big birthday snack and... Wait a minute. What's this? There's still one thing left in there, Bumpus. That's right, Tui. There is one thing left. I was so much thing about left. going home and making myself a snack that I forgot I still had one more thing in my mailbag. Oh! Zuzi Q got mud all over the package. That was very funny. But when she got through that splotch of mud, the mud flings upward. You see, if we stop on this frame, the mud splotch is higher than the ground in the bottom. And that seems like it's kind of impossible with just physics as the mud cannot fling like that. So if anything, the splotch of mud must be the same height as the ground, not above it. And in real life, that would not happen. If only I could wipe the mud off, then I could read the address. That's it! I'll make a super duper weeble wiper offer! A super duper weeble wiper offer? Uh, hello, what's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? He's so fast! <laughs> oh, he's so shocked. Oh, the mud's still not coming off! This is a really hard puzzle, Bumpus. Yeah, it looks hard. I don't know who can build something like that. Okay, but well, I wanna go first. I wanna go first. No, tough to play his two heads. Oh, the package is springing up. <laughs> That's very showy for animation. And then the package lands on Tui's head. <laughs> and some of the mud has broken off the package. That's a very funny clue. What would happen if everybody jumped? Mm, what would happen? Ooh, that's the funniest dance of Weebles. Okay, let's do it together. <laughs> Wiggle, 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 jump, 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 jump! Ah, the mud's broken off! The mud breaking off a package is so impossible 
That wouldn't happen on Earth either. I also like the show so much because the weebles are made from different kinds of animals. And there's so many problems and puzzles to solve in the show. So do you think the first episode is realistic or is it impossible? Well, whatever you just saw in the first episode is kind of impossible. And also, there was lots of episodes in the show, but we're not sure whether the other episodes are realistic or impossible. And there are other new characters, and there are going to be more puzzles and clues in these episodes. So tell me what you think about the show, and who is your favorite out of the five characters in the episode? And what can your favorite part be? Is it the letters flinging out of the mailbag, an umbrella opening inside out, having a splotch of mud fling up and onto the package, or doing the Weeble Watusi to make the mud break off the package? Well, maybe we'll be the lucky ones to find out once and for all, couldn't we? And I really hope that someday I will create the comic of the Weebles episode, and it would be very great. So head on over there to see some exclusive stuff that you can't find on YouTube. You can also check out projects we'd like to do in the future. And if you sign up, they'll even take your suggestions far more seriously than the ones you'll find here. So please like, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And this is Gustav Lappin, coming at you at the 12. Goodbye. I'll see you all next time.